The CDC says further guidance on reopening schools will not come until at least the end of this month. That leaves local districts doing what they can to put their own plans in place. Today, 13 on your side, Sarah Makuta spoke with a local teacher to hear what she thinks about everything. My number one concern is doing what's right for kids and what's right for our community. Kelly Vanderhoek is an English teacher in the Coopersville Public Schools. She says she wants to go back to school. I miss it. I know that the students want to be in school. Their parents want them to be in school. But we have to do that safely. In-person interaction is, is really important. And we saw that last spring. I think that all online classes work for some kids in certain situations. My personal thought would be to have kids in school, perhaps on a staggered schedule um, with, with smaller class sizes to allow for proper social distancing. Certainly, uh, masks are an important piece of that too. Today, parents in Coopersville received a letter detailing options. The high school staff will meet on Monday. Superintendents and principals have already been in talks through virtual meetings. It's a tight timeline, and I know for myself and for my colleagues and the community, they just want to know what's going to happen. I think that there's a comfort in knowing and being able to move forward with whatever plan they're going to be using. So my hope is that we can come up with that soon and get that information out. Sarah Makuda, 13, on your side.